How's it going once again guys and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Liberation and last time we were together we were about to start this mission so I think we're going to go and do that. So how are you guys today? I suppose I should probably ask that after we've done what I assume is going to be a cutscene, I think. And then we'll have a bit of a chit chat, you know, have a bit of a Gerald, talk. Gerald, I'm hearing about <laughs> disappearing slaves again. I thought we ended that with Gouverneur Dabadi. But it happens again and not only slaves now but laborers, the poor. Where are they all going? I'll set my informants on finding out. No. I'll do it myself. They need help now. May I suggest that you, um, start with Saint-Danger this time? Yes. This is one case we won't solve at the garden party. When you're ready to go, find me outside, near the docks. I'll show you a faster way there. Okay, cool. So, we're going after someone, I believe. So, change into the Assassin's Persona. Can we do that here? Oh, okay, so we can do that behind this. I suppose that makes sense. He did say that we could do, we, you know, we could change clothes behind that thing. So, it makes a small amount of sense, you know? Right. So, let's go with the Assassin's Persona and take a boat to Bayou. Is that the swamp place? I think Bayou may be, yeah, because those, those were the, um, they were like protecting the swamp or something. Those guys that we were killing at one point, you know. The kind of controversial ones. The ones that look like they lived there, but then we were attacking them. Although, I think they may be Templars, possibly. Anyway, moving swiftly on. The one thing I've found about this game so far is everything is a lot closer. Very close, if you know what I mean. Like, all the objectives that you're going to are a lot closer than in the previous games. Which, I suppose, kind of makes sense because it's a, it's a much smaller game. It has to be because it was coming out on the PS Vita. You know, but... I don't, I don't, I'm not sure whether it feels right on a console. Does that make sense? I know, I know I feel like I'm constantly complaining about this game, but I'm not. That's the thing, I'm not. It's actually very good. I'm enjoying it. I really am. I'm just trying to find things... <laughs> or maybe I'm just trying to find things to moan about. <laughs> That's distinctly possible. How's my uh, mood today? What's my serotonin level like? simply on? come here when you need to travel out of town. The, uh, business will cover any expense. Okay, so what are we doing? What are we doing? What are we doing? Oh, we're going to buy you. All right. Sequence four, I think, or it might be sequence two. Whichever it is a sequence. So, Animus notes, after taking care of her father's business troubles, Aveline sets out to uncover the truth behind the mysterious disappearances of slaves and vagrants. So, that'll be that guy. Didn't we already hear that guy talking about getting slaves and vagrants, or was that non diegetic like did we not actually hear that hmm mm. uh, yes yes see hmm <laughs> that guy knows what, what, knows what I'm talking about with his humming and harring and general humming alright I'm going over here to get oh that's that one you know what sod it I'm leaving it I don't think the chests are that important I told myself I wasn't going to do that <laughs> even though I probably am going to continue doing that like wait I'm going to go over there and get that chest one of many. Oh look, it's this guy. How's it going, buddy? This is the mentor, I believe. And Ginger Walsh here is online. Hello if you're watching the video. Du -du 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 -du. Aveline, what troubles you? I'm investigating new reports of disappearances. Are you missing anyone? It does seem that way. It's but so guy. many rest here before moving on. It is not always apparent where or why a man has gone. Your friend, Elise, hires many people to work. She may know better. Perhaps. I feel a great change coming. You will face powerful foes. Please, take this. A new poison I have been testing. It makes the victim momentarily hysterical. Berserk. Thank you, venerable one. All right, so we got ourselves some berserk darts. So I suppose eventually we're going to get the sleep darts. Right, should we, should we try out the berserk darts? I'm an idiot, aren't I? Because I keep swapping to that. They've changed the, uh, they've changed the setup on this one. Right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and set that to that. There we go. And I'm going to set the... Maybe the poison darts to the... Well, actually, I could go with the sword. The cutlass, I think, is a little bit better than the axe. 
I think because I've been playing so much um, Assassin's Creed 4, I'd forgotten the whole HUD mechanic of Assassin's Creed 3, because it was very different, wasn't it? But yeah, so we figured that out now. So, and I'm going to put the smoke bombs down the... Oh, wait, I've got gun? Oh, yeah, of course I have a gun. <laughs> I'm a fool. I've got all these tools that I've just not been using. I'm an idiot. I, I, at one point, I was whining about it, wasn't I? So sorry about that. I think I might have been ripping all the game, being like, wait, where's the sword? Why can't we use the sword? So, yeah, I I will instantaneously take that back. Well, instantaneously? No, I can't take it instantly back, can I? Because I said it days ago. <laughs> anyway, let's move on with talk to Elise. Okay. How's it going, Elise? How's your mother? Evelyn, old girl, where you been? The swamp's not the same without you. The gators are getting uppity. Oh, Uppity. you know, business demands and piano recitals. Ah, <sighs> how I've missed the bayou air. It has the scent of action about it. Among other things. Listen, I'm glad you're here. The other day I saw something and I said to myself, Elise, old girl, something's not right. Convoys loaded with the strangest cargo. People. Dozens of them. Where were they headed? I can't say. But I know where they came from. The fort. Okay. Will you show me the place? Thought you'd never ask. Meet me tomorrow. I'll mark your map. Fantastic. So when she says tomorrow, she of course means in about, I don't know, a minute and a half? In the time it takes me to run from here to over there? <laughs> Alright, go, go. And we go. Up the tree. Run across. Let's see how fast we can get there. Let's see if we can get there without touching the swamp again. That's always something I like trying. Ooh. Or maybe we can even get there without needing to even get on the ground. No. Oh, shit. That was close. Oh, no. I don't think we're going to be able to do it. No. Okay. Bail out. Bail out on that one. Although I will run across. That is not a beam. I think I'm going to have to swim. Yep. I'm definitely going to have to swim this one. I could have probably got up got high up into the trees, but I don't know. Can I go high up into those trees? That would be kind of cool if I could. Like, right on top of the trees. Because you just know there's going to be a uh, leap of faith section at the top of all of them. <laughs> like, if you could get there, you'd want to leap of faith off that. Into the swamp. Eaten by a crocodile. Nope, oh, didn't want to go in there. My bad. How did she get here so fast? Oh, wait, no. It's a day later, of course. Okay. A carriage just passed. We can catch it at the bend. I'll race you. Wait, what? We're racing? How is this acceptable? I thought this was supposed to be business. <laughs> you shouldn't miss business and racing. It just doesn't work. Get out of the way, Elise. No, I will beat you. I am slightly faster than you. Ever so slightly. So I think she can only win if she catches me on the corners. So, murder, murder, murder. I think it may in fact be a whole heap of murder. Alright, so eliminate the soldiers' ex escorts. Okay. If I can get nice and close without any of them... Wait, shall I... That may be a possibility. Let's use the berserk dart. Always fun to use. Okay, and quickly... Wait, can we turn that guy into the... Oh, there we go. That'll do. Did we get him? I don't think we did get it. Let's get a little bit closer. There we go. Oh, what? I don't think I can hit him from here. What about if I hit that guy? Ah, oh, there we go. Perfect. And let's also do this guy as well. And another one. And now just let's watch them tear each other to pieces. <laughs> so I just getting everyone else to do my work for me. Although all these trees are in the way. I could shoot them now from a distance. Although, do you reckon that would be a bit mean? Alright, swap out for the guns. Oh, ho, ho, that guy's winning. That guy's a badass. Oh, shit, don't you come for me. And we win. I recognize these people. Some of them have worked for me. Chris Faye. A word? Elise. What are you doing here? That's five. What does it look Six. like? Rescuing you. From what? Employment? Freedom? 
Uh, Chris Fay, these chains don't exactly say freedom to me. Temporary discomforts. Too many workers escaped the last voyage without paying their fare. We'll be released once we reach the worksite. These terms don't concern you. Elise, everything in this life concerns me. But I can survive a little longer till we get south to freedom. I don't trust this. Chris Fay, I promise we'll get to the bottom of this. But... We should investigate the fort while the time is ripe. With all the soldiers in town, there can't be many left. Elise! I like your thinking. Good. I'll scout ahead. Find me at the bridge. And Chris Fay? Keep out of trouble while we go stir some. Right. Thanks. So have we just ruined that guy's job? I know I, I know he was probably going to be doing slave work and that sort of thing, but he seemed quite up for it. <laughs> like he didn't seem to mind. He's like, well, a job's a job. <laughs> It was, it was a little kind of a bit bizarre conversation, if you know what I mean. Like, he, he didn't seem to want to be rescued out of the chains that he had around his hands. It was strange. But anyway, regardless of that, there is another mission up here, which is once again quite close. All these viewpoints that are there, I should really do some of them, shouldn't I? Should I do this one? Because that looks like it's a quite cool viewpoint. Yeah, I'm going to climb this while I'm here. Right, up we go, because I've not climbed one in a while, and this is a massive tree. And this looks really interesting to climb, as viewpoints go. Keep going, and climb on the mushrooms. Okay, that's not a mushroom, but fair enough. Oh shit. Do you reckon, do you reckon we get back up there? We can. Okay, shimmy along. There we go. Right. Oh, that's, that's vaguely conveniently placed. <laughs> what about this one? Can we do it again? Oh, oh my god. What is your problem, lady? I was mad. And we've, we've done it again. Okay, okay, go round, 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 round. And, no, shimmy. Why are you shimmying? Okay, maybe if we jump. I can't seem to get on that beam. That's a bit weird. It just won't let me get up there. Maybe if I... Oh, no, there we go. I don't know why it wasn't letting me get around before. Okay, the final bit. We have almost done it. To the top of the tra tallest tree in the jungle. Is that the top of the tallest tree? I think that might be that. That is awesome. <laughs> and now she's going to jump off into a pile of leaves or hay or, I don't know, people. Just a general pile of stuff. Which one are we just... Is it that one over there? That can't be the one over there. I can sod it. Jump. Shit. Into the swamp. Vaguely disgusting, but it's okay. At least we're alive. <laughs> Diving headfirst into a into a dirty swamp. I suppose needs must. Right. On with the main objective now that we've had a little side quest. Oh, there's a guy on the bridge. There's a guy on the bridge. Should we kill the guy on the bridge? I feel like we should kill the guy on the bridge. I'm sorry, Mr. Man, but you're gonna die. Come on. Come on. Down you go. Down you go. And it keeps reminding me about that chain kill. I should probably use that a little bit more. Alright, that's one thing that I was quite impressed about this game, like that chain kill ability. I know it makes it very much a sort of quick time event type game. Um, but for something on the PS Vita, that's kind of perfect, if you know what I mean. Right. Wait, what? Okay, that that was creepy. When I was back there, she looked like she had all grey bits in her hair. Wait, go back a little bit. Wait, look, see what I mean? From the back, she looks like an old, old man now, because she got grey hair. Okay, right. Let's have a bit of a chit chat. Now's our best chance. The highest ranking man I've seen is a teniente. He's lightly protected, but the fort is so big, we'll need to be smart to find him. I think we can handle that. Oh, I. One thing confuses me. What would the Spanish want with the people of Saint Danger? Why them? Why now? This isn't the Why first not? time I've detected irregular activity around the Spanish. When they were first taking over, I stumbled on a plot to control the Gouverneur and divert slaves to some underground project. And? I thought I made sure it wouldn't happen again. Let's go make doubly sure. Okay. So who are we killing? Eliminate the guards and remain undetected. So we've got to kill all the guards. Alright, we can do that. Oh, that guy's going to see me. That guy's going to see me. That guy, I think, has seen me. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, it's okay, it's okay, I'm hidden, I'm hidden. I am sneaky, and I am hidden. Okay, maybe, maybe we want to go with a poison dart on this one. Wait, there we go, so we'll set that to that, just so we've got it ready. 
Okay, let's get in the bush, and we'll try that one again. Wait, I'm not firing at anybody. Oh, that'll do. And we got him. I think we just hit him with the poison dart. Did we? We did. Okay, so we killed that guy. Right, I'm gonna go hell for leather on this one. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna run up to this guy and take him down. A running kill always seems to be an interesting kill. And it's a kill. Alright, go, 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 go. Shit, that guy's looking in my direction. Okay, into the bush. Shit. No, no, what are you doing? What are you doing? You bloody fool. Okay, right. That guy's gonna see me. That guy's definitely gonna see where me. Did she go? I don't know where she where went. Did she go? It's your job to find her. She's sneaking uh -huh. up on you. Oh, 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 oh. Ah! No, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Just sneaking up on all the guards. These guards are terrible. I'm not sure they deserve their wages. Dun 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 Okay, so we've made it into the fort. Should we go into the fort? We probably should go into the fort. Stop her! I was wondering whether we need to actually... Oh, crap. Nice. Well shot. Okay, kill the Spanish officer. Jesus Christ, that guy's... That, that girl's a pretty good shot. Okay, run, 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 run. If she keeps covering me, I can chase this old man. I'm quite surprised this old man is this quick. Ah, oh, what? Okay, over there, go. And another one. Oh, catch him, catch him, catch him. Ah, oh, there's a chest right there. That is... That is mean. That makes me want to get that chest. Come here, you. Okay, looks like we're fighting to the death. Oh, oh, oh. That was a bit brutal. I suppose interrogation's out of the question now. There are quicker is. ways to get at the truth. I'm not sure. We could have just asked the guy. Um, to be honest, that would probably be my first point of call. Would just like before we kill him, ask him. <laughs> you know. All right, guys. I think I'm going to end that one there. So thanks for joining me in this other episode. In another episode, I suppose I say other like this too. There's not in another episode of Assassin's Creed Liberation. I hope to see you in the next one. And another episode will be up soon. So yeah, take care, guys. Have a good day. Bye.